Well, good morning from Northwest Tennessee. A cloudy day, which is nice because we're driving east. Into the sun. Into the sun. So it's if it's cloudy, <laughs> don't worry about it. We're heading off on a short uh, one week trip. We're going to go up to Virginia, see the kids, grandkids, and the new to us great grandson. Great great grandson, right? No. Oh, great. Great, great grandson instead of just the grandkids. So the, one of the grandkids, the oldest one, uh, Kristen, had a really cute little boy, so we're gonna go up and check it out. We're also going to uh, go to Isabel's, uh, that being my granddaughter, her high school graduation. Yay! Yay. You ready? Yeah. So down the road we go, off to Virginia. While we're standing on the corner of Winslow, Arizona, Altoona, Cheyenne, or down in Punta Gorda. And if your RV needs some minor repair, Dave will give you tips down at Camp Sinclair. Man, see, you gotta get seat belts on you. Yeah. <laughs> trying to get back in the swing of things. We haven't filmed for quite a while. <laughs> Here we go. Uh, turbo. Pressure on for some little in case we need to blow a horn and get people off the road. Let's see, orbs. We will when we drive up here and say hi to Bobby and stuff. They're sitting up. Are they? Yeah. Oh, cool. Okay, so we'll get back to you. Well, first stop was a rest stop outside of Jackson, Tennessee, about an hour, hour and a half east of Jackson on I 40. It's a nice little rest stop. We can check the tires, make sure everything's looking good. Do a little walk around and take off for Nashville. Next stop is Nashville, Tennessee, where we're gonna fill up with fuel at the TA truck stop using our TSD card. Probably save a little bit over $6 off of the whole fill up, which that's like two gallons free. After leaving Nashville, we were a little bit ahead of the schedule, so we thought we'd stop at Dunlap RV Sales right outside of Lebanon, Tennessee. Uh, we thought we'd take a look at a motorhome they had sitting there, found out it was too new and way above our budget, so we carried on. Nothing like crawling along at four miles an hour on I-40 East. Apparently there was a big wreck in front of us. We're just outside of Lebanon, Tennessee, heading east. And if I look at my rearview mirror, I can't see where the trucks end. It just keeps going and going and going. Okay, now they want to go over that lane. Apparently we needed a CB so we can figure out what to do from now on. I used to have one in here, we took it out. It's all Shirley's fault. No kidding. Way says, watch out. Vehicle stopped on the road ahead. Car stopped in the head. Five tenths of a mile. Well, luckily, we weren't caught up in the traffic jam too long, about 10, 15 minutes. So it wasn't too bad. They had most of it cleaned up. And um, so we're not really sure what happened, but we hope everybody came out okay. Our final stop of the day was a TA truck stop outside of Balington, Tennessee, and it's not too far from the border, I think about 200 miles or, or so from the uh, Virginia border. So we spent the night here, great place, very clean, very nice uh, employees, they really took care of us, and they had some pretty cool trucks sitting around that were, you know, like old pickup trucks and army trucks that had been restored. Kind of a neat place. If you're just going by there and want to see some neat trucks, stop in and take a look.
Well, good morning from Baylington. Baylington. Tennessee. We're heading up to Virginia today. We we spent the night at the, the TA. Beautiful place. Clean, nice. Uh, people very friendly. And we use a TSD card. We're going to save a bunch of money. Mm -hmm. Probably about as much as we did yesterday, about six dollars a gallon. So that's like two gallons free. So here we go. We're off, heading north. It's down the road we go. Yeah, down the road. Mm -hmm. yeah, that's good. Okay. Let's. Uh, oh, address. Where are we going? This was our final rest stop. Of course, you know, we always stop in the morning after about an hour or two to check everything out. And this was up in Virginia. Really nice rest stop, nice and clean. And that's what we like. So, you know, from here we carried on and the next stop will be Kristen's house up in, uh, farther up in Virginia. And we're gonna spend a couple days up there. So really, thanks for coming along for the ride. I hope you enjoyed this short little video and it's good to be back. Well, good morning from somewhere in Virginia. We're in, uh, I guess, Southwest Virginia. Just barely crossed the line about an hour from Tennessee, hour, hour and a half maybe, two hours, I don't know. I think we had 270 miles to go when we left Tennessee, so I guess that's how far into Virginia we are. And we're mooch docking at the granddaughter's house. It's a new house, she's only, they've lived in it a couple years, I think and uh barn looks nice but i don't have to mow up there but yep junior's uh sitting there kind of mooch docking we're in the street in the curb something like that had to get it level took a look we got a nice uh, power cord so we got power for the refrigerator and all so we went to burn propane yeah we had to get up off the curb a little bit put some wood down and we got it straightened out and nice and level so the refrigerator's working real good. It doesn't work great on propane. It works, but it keeps it like about 40. That's about it. Now when we put it on electricity, it'll be down in the uh, 20s. So, which is, <laughs> it'll freeze everything up by the time we leave here in about three or four days. So, but anyway, we're in Virginia. We're having a good time so far. It's a little cloudy. Gonna clear up though, maybe a little bit later. And not sure what's on the schedule for today. Thanks for watching Down the Road We Go. I hope you enjoyed this episode and don't forget to subscribe and make sure you click the little bell so you get notified every time a new episode comes out. Thanks again for watching Down the Road We Go.